Hi, this is Jim Whitley from the World Famous Tool Shed. Uh, today is Wednesday the 13th. We're re reopening on tomorrow, which is Thursday the 14th, uh, after my hiatus here. All right, so let's go over some of the stuff we have. Uh, Hobart Stickmate 205 uh, arc welder is 175 with the cart. Got that shovel there, that is 850. Table saw craftsman that is two hundred and fifty dollars. One fifty on the um, floor stapler. Hundred and fifty on the drill press. This drill press is sixty dollars. The benchmate um, ratchet and socket set that is seventeen dollars and fifty cents. Sixty dollars on the Ryobi tile saw. Central pneumatic uh, HVLP gun that's ten dollars. Bargain table is a dollar. I don't know if I already said that. Sawzall, fifteen dollars. Uh, manual tile cutter that is ten bucks. Another tile cutter that is forty-five dollars. Again, dollar on that stuff. Can't remember what I went over. What I haven't. It's been a few weeks, so we got a bunch of sawzalls. Uh, Dewalt rigid, old Milwaukee ones. Porter cable. Uh, framing guns on the bottom come along a lug all come along tool belts old school welding helmets clamps the apron there I think is five uh, four dollars and fifty cents the mortising kit has the four mortising pieces four mortising drill bits plus it has this riser which I've never seen for one of these before comes with a stand that is three hundred Got the Chicago electric welder, that is 120. The uh, Dow tile 828 uh, stainless um, tile saw, that's 325. Got some Jorgensen clamps, $5 each. Milwaukee M18 chargers, $10. M18 sander, I think that's 35. The M18 drill is, is priced somewhere 30 bucks. I do not have any batteries for those. We, oh, I forgot about this. Uh, like I said, it's been here for a while. Um, Eight hundred dollars on the on the uh, vice. We got the router table with the stand. That's fifty-five dollars. The husky set here. This is all those pieces for the bargain price of fifty bucks. Nut driver set, Craftsman. That one's eight dollars. The one underneath there, the other Craftsman Evolve. That's ten dollars. $45 on the wire, uh, $15 on the Bessie clamps. And all right, let's go over, uh, we got this rolling tool bag, that's $40. Buck Brothers um, carving tools, that's five. This guy's five, this guy's four. We get the Whirly Gigs, which I can't remember what the real name of them is, those are $2 each. The Craftsman Scroll Saw, $60, or is that $50? That is $60, comes with the stand. All right, uh, Mark, who's been asking about the other quarter and sec, because uh, my buddy John has never come in to freaking pick the other one up. I got a set here for you. This is for you. Come and get it. It's 40 bucks. Uh, SK 3 8 drive set. That is 70, 70, what is it, $70. Dollar on, the, um, dollar on the strap. The, the uh, channel locks, 8 and uh, 9 50 750 on the rigid uh, basin wrench, two dollars on the on the putty knife, 550 on the um, crescent. Um, no, I'm sorry, channel lock needle nose pliers. Two twenty-five dollars on the Klein kit here uh, with the multimeter, the uh, power indicator, and the uh, the polarity thing or whatever the hell it is. Knives, dollar fifty for most of those. Somewhere uh, down to seventy-five cents. Non-retractable ones, four dollars on the silver solder. The Klein knife, I had to put a price on that. Klein nut drivers, those are three dollars each. One twenty-five on the snap-on nut driver. Five and five fifty on the crescent adjustable wrench. Oh, that one's seven dollars. That one's a lot bigger. Um, Klein pliers. That Klein plier. That's not. That's crescent. That's four fifty. Klein pliers, fifteen dollars. This one's nine fifty. This guy is not Klein. That's a uh, that's or something like that. Uh, Eight dollars. 
Klein Lyman Ply for $15, $3 on the hammer. The quarter inch driver, two bucks. Wiss um, shears, six dollars. Three fifty on the Allens, and uh, five fifty on the Greenlee tester. Uh, rigid tubing cutter, five dollars. All right, I know there's other stuff I wanted to show. I forgot what it was. I got distracted. Someone came to the door because it was supposed to be open right now, and I'm not open. Anyways, those are my problems. So, anyways, we'll see you soon. Uh, Thursday through Saturday this week, one to five.